boy, bro. What are you doing? What's it look like, Wheeler? I'm playing Minecraft. Well, enough children's video games. We're gonna go play a children's card game. I want a rematch. Why should I give you a rematch? Uh, probably because you always cheat, you use your money, and or you just don't read the card correctly. I don't know what you're talking about, Wheeler. That was all skill there. Oh, come on, Kaiba. I'll give you a golden apple. Psh. As if I would want one of those pathetic items. Besides, you oh. probably don't even have one. Oh, all I have is lapis now. Oh, lapis? You got a deal! Uh. All right, Kaiba. Let's flip a coin to see who goes first. All right, then. I'll call it Tails, dude. Oh, hey, would you look at that? Yeah, I get to go first. Oh, wait. No. It landed on heads, didn't it? Ah, I don't know. Shapes or colors. I draw! All right, Wheeler, I'm going to activate Thunder Dragon from my hand. By sending it to the graveyard, I can draw two more Thunder Dragons. Yeah, tell me something I don't know, rich boy. There's a lot in this world you don't know. And give me an example. Do you know what Pot of Greed does? Oh, no. No, uh, usually I have to read the card out loud so that everybody knows. <laughs> read the cards. Ah, see, Wheeler, this is why you're a third-rate duelist. Wait, Kai, but do you not read your cards before you play them? Nah, man. Do you even know what Thunder Dragon does? Nope. Alright, go polarization! Oh, shit. Koiba, stop summoning your brother every time we duel. Whoa, 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 okay? My monster is not that ugly, okay? That's a little fucking rude, Joey. I don't know what you see in it, but it's mostly a head. Wheeler. It's... Two heads. Well, it's got two mouths, I wouldn't say two heads. It's kind of a misleading name. Next thing you're gonna tell me, Lord of D isn't a dragon. Well, I mean, he's dressed like a dragon. Yeah, and that makes him a dragon. Well, I don't know if you know that, but this monster right here isn't even a dragon. What are you talking about? Read the thing below, it's a thunder type. What the fuck? Alright, take a turn. I place one card face down. And then I summon Panther Warrior in attack mode, and I end my turn. Hmm, there's a monster in attack position, and a face down. Nah, I'm sure it's not a trap. I'll set one card in defense position, and I'll have my Thunder Dragon attack your monster. I end my turn. I summon the Blue Flame Swordsman in attack mode, and I end my turn. I'll sacrifice my monster, summon out Lust for Dragon, number two. Oh, jeez. He's uh, kind of melting into the other one's hand. Hey, a dragon inside of another dragon doesn't get better than that. Uh, I mean, are you watching dragons fuck or what? No, 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 no. Watching documentary on them fucking. Completely hey, different. Documentary, whatever you say. Don't fucking judge me, Wheeler. Well, I'm judging you because you're too busy looking at dragon dicks to actually learn how to play Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah, and you're too busy getting your fucking ass whooped to get a real job. Hey, fuck you! Hey, fuck you! A uh, thunder dragon attack your blue flame swordsman. I activate magic alarm shield. I'm gonna use luster dragon as your new attack target. All right, I draw. I've got this one in the bag. What the fuck is that? I play one monster face down, and I end my turn. I'll set one card face down, and then I'll activate Monster Reborn and get back my Lust World Dragon. Ah, uh, you just love bringing your dragons back. The voodoo magic. Listen, it's not voodoo, it's science. I resurrected a dragon from the dead. That's all science right there. Look, I'm from Brooklyn. Science, magic, it's all the same thing. I'm afraid of all of it. What are you not afraid of? Well, I'm not afraid of dragons, I guess. Dragons are like uh, mythical creatures. They don't really exist. You fucking take that back, you son uh, of a bitch. You fucking take that back right now. Look, Koiba, they, they, they're not real. Yes, they are, all right? Yes, they are. Mokuba told me, all right? They're real. What did Mokuba tell you? That they said one day in the orphanage will get swooped up by dragons and be taken off to a magical land. And then we'll meet all the other dragons. And then we'll mm. be family. You know, I think I've heard that plot before. I'll have Thunder Dragon attack your blue flame swordsman. Alright, I'm gonna summon Time Wizard in attack mode. I'm gonna activate the effect of Time Roulette. Hey, would you look at that? Looks like all your monsters are destroyed. Every time. Why? How do you always get it? It doesn't make sense. The odds aren't that lucky. Look, Kaiba, this card was given to me by my best friend, Yugi. It always sticks with me. Listen, Joey, you're not that lucky to get heads every time. Well, I mean, if you look back, I don't. Okay, but one the time, time in the cave, 
versus the thousand other times he used it does not count for fairness. Well, I mean, I think it's just, you know, good luck. You call me the cheater. I'm no cheater. At least I don't spend money on shit. What can I say? EA's my bitch. All right. Well, you might say it's dumb luck, but I'm going to summon a dragon of my own. I activate polymerization. Fuse together my time wizard and baby dragon, thousand dragons. Oh my god, Joey. That's actually pretty fucking cool. Holy shit. Yeah, so time wizard and baby dragon, when they fuse, Time Wizard ages up Baby Dragon into maturity, which makes him very strong. Kaiba, put your dick oh, back shit. in your pants! Oh, what? No, that was one of my trading cards! No! Kaiba, that's my dragon! I don't know what you were seeing, Wheeler. That was just another one of my valuable cards. It sure looked like a dick to me. <laughs> nah, man, it's my, uh... Lord of D. Alright, well, I place one card face down, then I attack you directly with... Thousand Dragon! Put one card in defense position. And I'll set one card face down, and I'll end my turn. All right, I draw. All right, Koiba, I activate the effect of question. Now, Shit. it's a really simple one. Who's the first monster in my graveyard? Uh, uh, the shitty one. Yeah, I'm gonna need a better answer than that, Koiba. Come on, time's uh, running out. Um, Thousand Dragon! Come on, Koiba. Is it or is it not? Look at the field. Is it or is it not Thousand Dragon? No, it's not Thousand Dragon. Fuck! The real card was Panther Warrior. Ah, I was close. Uh, yeah, really, really close. All right, now I place one card face down. All right, Thousand Dragon. Time to attack Kaiba's face down. Now, Panther Warrior, attack the rich boy. Hey, you can't attack without sacrificing a monster. Well, it's a good thing I'm gonna win. So I sacrifice Thousand Dragons so Panther Warrior can attack you. Ha, huh, I activate Negate Attack. Oh no, I just got rid of one of my best monsters. What a fool, Joey. Looks like luck's on my side, Joey. <laughs> Cause I activate Pot of Greed. I activate Soul Exchange and I'll destroy your monster. Oh God. Summon out my Judge Man. All right, Judge Man, attack Joey directly. Oh, uh, Koiba, you're not reading your cards again. Reading's for chumps. Attacking's for winners. Oh, well, I activate Nutrient Z. When you attack me with a monster with 2,000 more attack points, I gain 4,000 life points. I end my turn. And <laughs> nice. I play one card face down and I activate Monster Reborn, allowing me to summon Baby Dragon in attack yes. mode. Baby Dragon. Yeah, Baby Dragon. All the monsters you could have gotten, and you choose Baby Dragon. Well, I'll, I'll be honest with you, Kaiba. He, he was the first one I saw, and I just, I, I panicked. Joey, if that wasn't a dragon, I would kick your ass. I draw. You're not going to win with pathetic cards like that. Yeah, we'll see, rich boy. I'll set one card face down. Then I'll activate Card of Demise. Now I'm going to drop the five card. Oh, boy. Why is he cutting all of his cards in half? Because he's edgy, just like me. Kaiba, if you cut all your cards in half, you won't have any more blue eyes. Remember, there's only three in existence since, you know, you took Yogi's grandpa's and ripped it in half because you were petty. Listen, I had to be sure no one else could have used it. I don't want to, I don't want to spoil it for you, but he still has the card. What do you mean he still has the card? I literally ripped it in half, threw it on the ground, and didn't check if they grabbed it. What do you mean by that? Well... He technically taped it back together. Is that even illegal? Well, I mean, he's not using it, but he still has it. Listen, I want you to go find fucking Mr. Moto, and I want you to fucking rip his goddamn fingers apart. I don't want him to be able to use that card again. What's that, Kaiba? Ah, nothing. Just talking to Mokuba. Oh, well, I guess tell him I said hi. Yeah, we just says fuck you. All right. That's not what I said. I summon out Lord of D in attack position, and then I activate the spell card. Flute of Summoning Dragon! That's like the only card Kaiba knows how to use! And I'm gonna summon out my two blue eyes white dragons! Oh god, two of them?! Alright, Lord of D, attack Baby Dragon directly! Not so fast, Kaiba! I activate Fairy Box! This might be my one chance to win! Alright, so I have to call a heads or tails. If I call it correctly, your monster's attack goes down to zero. I call heads! Yeah! I activate Matter Transport! 
I'll be banishing Lord of D so it doesn't get destroyed. I'll have my blue eyes attack your baby dragon. All right. Hopefully lightning strikes twice. I'm gonna call heads. Nah, what are the odds of you getting right again? Hey, that's some Joey magic right there. Your blue eyes' attack goes to zero, and that makes it weaker than my baby dragon. Baby dragon, destroy his blue eyes and the rest of his life points. No! Kaiba, your time has come. Now you have to respect me like a real duelist. I'm never gonna respect you, Joey. But you have to, Kaiba. I won fair and square. You may have won this duel, Joey, but you lost your life. What do you mean? Yeah, he's still here. Yeah, the alley's fine. Alright, be there in two minutes. I wonder who he's talking to. Oh, you'll find out. He throwing me a party? It's, a, it's, a, it's kind of like a surprise, not surprise party. Well, I mean, it's not a surprise party if you tell me. Oh, there definitely will be a surprise for you, Joey. Oh, you talking like pizza? I love me some good pepperoni slices. Oh, there's gonna be a lot of pizza for you. Oh, well, that sounds great, Kaiba. <laughs> you know what, Kaiba? I was really looking forward to that pizza. Ah, thank you for your service. Anytime. You can always count on my guys. Hey everyone, just want to let you guys know that I'll be going to PAX East in Boston Friday and Sunday. That's March 29th and 31st. Uh, I'll just be walking around with a paper bag on my head. So if you see me, feel free to stop by and say hi. Okay, bye.